Hello everybody, this is the Bulldozer, and thank you for giving me your time, and thank you for watching another one of my videos. I really do appreciate it. Man, oh man, I am so glad to have this M82 done. And I'm going to show you this video here on how I get it gold, and that's when I realize that we have a problem. The snipers for the gold and the diamond are broken, and it's just like... There's just so many things wrong with this. Like, my console is still freezing and turning off. And I don't have to be doing nothing. My controller can be turned off, so the screen is dimmed. I'm on an Xbox One, not a new series. Xbox. And Call of Duty Cold War is still powering off my system. And uh, actually now it's starting to affect issues with Elgato. Because usually I would take and turn it back on and the Elgato would pick back up. If you don't know anything about the Elgato, when you don't have a signal, it pauses the recording. Then once the con once the signal is picked back up, you turn the Xbox back on, it continues recording. Well, twice now, the Elgato did not continue recording because of the signal loss from the Xbox. So I'm going to have to make Elgato aware of that also. I do know I got a patch update I got to install. That might fix it. I don't know. But when it comes to the sniper rifles, the M82, folks, you are going to be pulling your hair out with this sniper rifle. It's just absolutely insane. The hit markers on this thing. I mean, I got clips that when I do the M82 video, you're going to be literally six feet away from another person and... I get absolutely nothing at all. Then I got some footage to where you can see one of my shots actually went through the, you can see the smoke trail of the bullet. You can see that the smoke trail goes through the person's chest in the heart area and out the back. And did not, and when you go look at their screen, it does nothing to them. Needless to say, they, they lit me up. There's supposed to be a buff for this weapon. It cannot come soon enough, but I always get my sniper rifles knocked out right away. But I'm holding off on finishing the LW3 for a couple of reasons. And let's go ahead and get into that. I've spoken enough. You see, I need I got two more double kills that I need to get for the Bliss camo. And then I will have the M82 gold. Now the one actually I get at the very end of the game, like seconds before the game ended, I get that and that's actually the kill cam. Let's go ahead and take a look at the first one. I'm sitting here, I've been playing all Nuketown. Nuketown I think is the best place to play to complete a lot of these challenges right now. You saw that right there. I'm going to take it, I'm going to play this clip back for you. It's just crazy. The first shot goes high. I'll admit that. The second shot's low. Watch the third shot. Center chest. Did nothing. The fourth shot. It took two shots with the Barrett 50 cal to eliminate that person. You can see I got bloodthirsty there. Those are a pain in the butt. But I will give you some pointers when I do the MA2 video on uh, how I went about getting these bloodthirsties. And they might help you out. Um, a lot of people, when they do these class setup videos, they're showing you a lot of the stuff that you cannot unlock until the very end, which that is not the case. My Barrett 50 cal still is not finished. Right here is what I was talking about. Here comes the second double kill that I need to get gold. My guy's going to pop back out. And right there, and you see just seconds and that game ended but you never saw the information come up on the screen so I didn't know if it actually counted but if you watch right here I'm gonna eliminate this person right here that's that's number four then if you pay attention it says you know five and six so I did get the double kill there's five and right here comes times six and actually I, I'll be honest I think that bullet actually missed the person but it's Call of Duty for you. So the way I, when I found out that I actually got it because I didn't see the indication come up on the screen because it happened like seconds before the game ended. You can see rewards right here. You can see there we go. There's the gold M82. Now this is what I was wanting to talk about. Take a look at 
this right here. You see, for getting the M82 Expert, you got 5,000 XP. Then you get the M82 Master Badge, that's another 5,000 XP. And then for completing the Bliss Camo, that is 2,500 XP. That's 12,500 XP. That if you're running double XP, I'm not for sure, but I'm pretty sure that's going to turn into 25,000 XP. So in a minute, I'm going to show you how I need, I think it's just one kill on the LW3. And it would make absolutely no sense for me to go ahead and finish this weapon off because I'm assuming that I'm going to get another 5,000 XP when I unlock the diamond camo. So again, if you do that doing double XP, I'm pretty sure that is going to be a 10,000 XP um, play. So I would be wasting 35,000 XP if I was to complete that before Season 1 comes out. And if Season 1 comes out and there's no, no double XP going on, then I can always use my double XP token. That's why I haven't wasted those. Even though, another issue, leave a comment down below if you've come across this problem. I've had three of my double XP tokens, excuse me, two of my double XP tokens taken away from me. I don't know what happened to them. They obviously didn't expire because the ones I got in there now, I entered them all at the same time with the Mountain Dew 12-pack code. So all of a sudden, I had five. Then I used the one to try to um, see if I can get um, four times XP. And I, like he was able to do a couple Call of Duties ago, and it didn't work. So, so that was a waste. So then I had the four. Then all of a sudden, I have two. You can see right here, 18 and 2. Now, people want to say, why aren't you playing the objective? This is the reason why. It does me no good to go and, and capture that objective. I'm trying to get eliminations. If we was in the point to where we were supposed to be able to go to level 1,000, if I was max, max prestige and going into level 1,000, then I would get credit for doing that. So instead of me going over and doing that, you know, I'm just going to go straight and get my eliminations. Now you see right here the diamond and the gold. When you look at the diamond, it is going to say one of three. And that is not the case, folks. I have the Peloton gold and now the M82 gold. So that should actually say two of three with just the one camo left to finish on the LW3. Now take a look right here it is, the diamond one of three. It's like it is only registering this weapon. Because when I got the Peloton gold, and I gotta find out what video that's in. If I, if I, if I remember, I will add that clip. I, gotta, I don't know where that video is right now. I have to go research it. It said one of three also. But now, which I'll go ahead and show you the Peloton, it still says one of three. We're going to go down here. I'm going to switch this weapon here out. Go to the sniper rifles. I'm going to add the Peloton. Go into the camos and go all the way down. And you see it's gold right there. There's no lock there. I got the weapon gold. And we're going to move over to the diamond, and you can see it says one of three. But that Peloton looks pretty nice diamond. I, I do have to admit that. So, yeah, so we have an issue. Um, I don't even know if I want to take in, when the new season comes out, if I haven't heard of an update for this, or at least till I see two of three, I am not even going to finish off the LW3. Because until the Peloton and the M82 are registered, and it's showing two of three on both of those weapons, I'm afraid that I'm going to lose out on that 5,000 or maybe 10,000 XP for that diamond camo. And I don't want to take that chance. Because, again, you can see right here at the Bliss, for the LW3, all I need is one double kill. And that will give me the gold and the diamond for the sniper rifles. So, keep that in mind, folks. I know everybody wants to get these golds and, and diamonds and dark matter and dark ether and all that. 
but you got to be smart about this because the way they have structured the um, ranking system, and I'm going to put a video out about that, talking about that too. I got uh, all the XP needed from rank um, 1 going all the way through rank 100. Well, actually, like 50 something, then it glitched out. And as you saw, it was still glitched out. What you saw there at the end of that game, you had that blue circle, which is like flickering. That's basically what happened. They said I had 1.3 million XP, which was actually insane and not correct. Because I don't have, I don't get no XP because I'm at a max at Prestige uh, three. But keep that in mind. Keep track of your camos. If you want to go ahead and finish off these other camos, you're losing a little bit of XP, okay. But when you get that 5,000 XP for a camo, you get 5,000 XP for the gold. You get 5,000 XP for the diamond. That's a lot of XP to be losing when you're trying to rank up. And I'm not for sure offhand what the date is of season one when it's going to come out. But again, that is just going to be a lot of XP you're wasting. And then what's going to happen is if you are on this grind to do these uh, weapons cam weapon camos for the diamond and the dark, dark matter and dark ether, so on and so forth, you're going to find yourself struggling to rank up later in the season because you've completed all these camos excuse me you complete all these camos when you got no credit for doing so okay just to go over it here are my rewards again for the final camo you're going to get 2500 xp for the m82 master badge that's another 5000 xp and for getting the weapon gold you're going to get 5000 xp for the expert on that weapon so again Without counting the diamond, these three um, rewards right here are 12,500 XP. Okay, now I'll go ahead and show you what the gold um, Peloton and the gold M82 look like. Here is the Peloton. I really like the gold. I like the the dark like flakes in the gold. You know, it kind of looks like it's a, a brick of gold. It really does. It really has that effect, especially if you watch Gold Rush or any of those shows like that. And you see when they make, they take all the little flakes of gold and they make these bars. And that, that is exactly what it looks like. It has those little black specks in it. Go ahead and inspect it so you can see what it looks like. It's kind of cool how it pulls out the round. Now pay attention to that round. Because um, here in a second I'm going to show you the M82. And just look at the size of that that round there's no way in this world why well, again because it's call of duty here's the m82 why that round is not a one shot kill from the chest up i mean i've i've taken some weapons and shot people in the foot and and with one round and eliminated them it's nothing the size of the 50 caliber that's on this now take a look at this Look at that round. That is just one beefy round in there. But again, I like the effects of the gold. The gold looks really nice in Cold War. I'm not happy at all with the dark matter. Um, I do have a big tip because with the Peloton and with the um, LW3, or is it LW3? The Peloton and the MA2, I actually finished all my camos off before the last um, camos, last five camos were unlocked. And because of the fact you get so many hit markers with the M82, when I do the M82 gold video, I'm gonna show you a little trick that I used on how to rank it, rank it up, because you have to, in order to unlock those camos, you had to be at level 50. Well, I wasn't on level 48. I had over halfway to go through at level 48, then all the way to go through level 49. Now I'm going to show you a little strategy that I used on how I was able to unlock the uh, camos so I can go ahead and finish off the MA2 as fast as I did. Because if I would have done it the normal way, it would have taken so long, folks. So long. I even posted an image 
on Twitter when I finally finished off the um, five kills without dying. That was the worst camo to do. A, the MA2 is extremely loud. And B, the hit markers. I mean, you saw here in the beginning that shot number three was center mass of that chest and it did absolutely nothing to that person. I had to take and hit them with the fourth round in order to eliminate them. It took two rounds. And one of your challenges is you have to get, I think it's 50 one-shot kills, 25 or 50 one-shot kills. So again, that's going to be one you'll get it as you're playing but still it's going to take a little while to take and unlock that okay one last time here so you can see exactly what i'm talking about you see we have the gold m82 when you go over to the diamond camo it says one of three now we'll go ahead and we'll move over to the peloton so you can see the peloton i'm also going to show you the knife and the xm4 Here's the Peloton, and you can see it also says one of three, which both of those should say two of three. The Peloton and the ME2 are gold. Now we'll take a look at the knife. Knife was the first thing I think I got, I got gold. Um, I love using a knife. And you can see it says zero of two for the diamond, and that should say one of two because the knife is gold. It says, you know, unlock gold camera for the knife and a special weapon in multiplayer. Well, this is the special weapon. Um, the I, again, I cannot remember the name of this weapon, but basically a noob tube gun. And you can see it says zero of two, and that should say one of two. So again, uh, I know I'm repeating myself, but I hate to see you waste XP for unlocking gold, unlocking any reward that you're going to get five thousand XP for. We're going to go down and take a look at the XM4, the assault rifles, and the XM4 does appear to be working. I tell you, that gold looks absolutely sick, or the diamond, excuse me, looks absolutely sick on that weapon. But you see it does say 1 of 5 on the diamond for the assault rifles, so that is working. Just hopefully by the time I get to the end of this grind that they have dark matter fixed, um, because really... I. I think Dark Matter is absolutely horrible on this weapon. The Dark Aether for zombies looks a whole lot better. And that's another alternative that you could possibly do is that if you are still finding yourself ranking up and you're having problems ranking up because you finished all your camos in multiplayer, you can also go over to zombies and you can rank up in zombies as well and I think you can rank up in Warzone I don't play Warzone so I'm not really for sure about that but if you've already finished off your all your camos off in multiplayer and you got the the diamond and the dark matter for them, all the weapons in multiplayer just jump over to zombies play zombies and get those weapons I might do a tutorial on that uh, you know you can take in get up into you know 20 around 20 to 30 depending on what weapon you're using before you start struggling if you stay in that one confined area um, you'll be fine you don't have to worry about anything because you haven't opened up the main map area you haven't turned on the power you haven't done any of that stuff so you can keep running trains in that small circle which i will show you in the ma2 video Thank you for watching. Thank you for giving me your time. I really do appreciate it. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on. And I'm out of here.